KwaZulu Natal has been experiencing a spate of violent crimes. A few months ago, a number of bodies of women were found dumped in a sugarcane plantation in Umtualume. In September, nine people were shot and killed execution style in Gwandengezi in just one weekend. Over the weekend, a 35-year-old businessman, Eshvir Sukwa from Tongat, was stabbed multiple times and killed at his home in what is believed to have been a robbery. Over 80,000 rand was stolen during the incident. His 76-year-old father was also stabbed and is in a critical condition in hospital. Three suspects have been arrested and are due to appear in court on Wednesday. His dad has everything, but he doesn't have his son. Um, it's really a difficult time for the family. It's a difficult time for all each one of his friends. The way he died was uncalled for, and I really mm -hmm. do hope that justice will be served. A multidisciplinary roadblock operation was held in Pochepstein to launch a festive season crime prevention campaign. 40 people were arrested for various transgressions. Authorities promised police visibility throughout the festive season to fight criminality. This uh, is a month where we want to clap down. It's, uh, there's a, as you would see, the police, it's an integrated uh, law enforcement that we are employing here. Ndoli says more roadblocks will be conducted across the province, while liquor outlets and residential areas will be closely monitored. Simpio Makanya, SABC News, Pochepstein.